Going out to bat in his own back garden, Darrell Mitchell should have been playing Sussex this weekend, but his 18th season with Worcestershire is on hold. Middle, please, umpire. Yes, that's it. Two months ago, flooding was the biggest problem at New Road, but now it's the coronavirus that stopped play, creating a new challenge for Mitchell in his final year as chairman of the Professional Cricketers Association. Uh, when you're t talking about people's livelihoods, it's quite a, it's quite a big responsibility, and, and obviously everyone's got mortgages to pay and, and, and bills to pay, and, and actually the, the player reps in particular, I've been really proud of, of what they've done and, and what they've gone through, and, and sort of volunteer, volunteering to, to take pay cuts and, and, and things like that. It's been a really mature response. Back in September, carefree Worcestershire cricketers could never have dreamt they'd be furloughed in the spring, but that's what's happened at most counties until further notice. For Ollie Westbury, the Worcestershire batsman, being in lockdown is the perfect opportunity to launch his own cricket blog called Opening Pair. It's been quite popular, surprisingly, <laughs> really. Um, I didn't expect it to quite go down the way that it has done, but I really enjoy writing and I think I'm trying to make sure that the time that I've got here, I'm not wasting it. It is tough, but we're healthy and we're lucky to be healthy. So all we've got to do really is do nothing and we should, we should be able to do that. This has proved a brilliant opportunity for Ollie to have some time to really delve into that. We've been uh, reaching out to all our members, checking on well-being, but also supporting our members, uh, find ways to use this incredibly challenging period productively. County cricket's been around for, what, 150 years or so. I think, obviously, it's been through world wars before and come out the other side. I've, I've no doubt that county cricket will, will survive. Thousands of players and spectators alike are hoping Daryl Mitchell is proved correct. But like everyone else, he can only wait for lockdown to end before cricket can begin to get back to normal. Ian Winter, BBC Midlands Today.